Hey, what's guys? It's Dina Tran here. Welcome back to another video. So today, this video is going to be a little bit of a different video because today is basically gonna be a no school school day. Basically what that means is today is Saturday, so obviously I don't have school today. I don't have any classes going on, but I have a crap ton of school work that I need to do today. Yeah, one of the things that sort of happens to pretty much everybody in college is that things will pile up. You get like a lot of homework and a lot of assignments to do when you don't do them for a couple of days they just start to pile up that's basically what happened to me so today is just gonna be like a catch-up day so that's just what today's gonna be it's just gonna be me trying to get all as much stuff done as possible I'm gonna be working the entire day today on all of my homework assignments so right here on my phone I have a whole list of stuff that I want to get done today and I have a feeling it's gonna take all day today so I have given myself the entire day today to get this done it is about 10 15 a.m right now and i got nothing literally nothing going on in the day let's just get started with the assignments Whether you're in school or not, I think we've all had a point at least once in our life where we were just so behind on our stuff and we just had so much stuff piled on top of us that we need to get done. Or there's just like a crap ton of stuff that you don't want to do, but you know you have to get done. So in order to tackle all of that, I encourage you to do something like this. Dedicate an entire day to just doing all of that crap and getting all of that stuff done. And during the day, you know, it may seem like super super boring you know you don't want to keep on doing it but you get it all done that one day the next day reward yourself do something fun the day after this day i went to dave and busters with some of my family members and uh, yeah it was a nice little reward after getting a lot of stuff done the day before so go ahead and do something like this and then treat yourself So got a little bit of work done for my English or my writing essay and now it is about 12 p.m. So it's time to eat some lunch. So I'm gonna go downstairs, cook up some lunch for myself and then immediately after we're just gonna get back to work. Okay guys, just finished up eating lunch. Now it's time to get back to it. I'm gonna try and knock out this writing essay by like maybe 2.30 cause it's almost 1.30 right now. So I'm about like halfway through the essay I think. So should take me about another hour to get this one done and then we can move on to more assignments.
Okay guys, this is crazy. Like, I'm not even gonna lie. I literally just finished my essay and it is exactly 2.30. So I just need to turn it in real quick and then I can get started on my next assignment, which I think I'm gonna work on my AIS class, which is basically like a freshman introductory class. I got a big assignment that I gotta do that's due tomorrow and we had like three weeks to work on it, but I haven't even started on it yet. I gotta get that done today and I have a feeling it's gonna take a long time because he gave us three weeks to do it. It may take me the rest of the day today and I may not even get to like all the other stuff that I wanted to do. So yeah, but you know, the good news is finish my essay. So let's get started on this assignment. So I think the hardest thing about any project or assignment is starting it. I mean, I found that when I was starting this new assignment for my class, I knew it was gonna take a really long time. So that's why I just did not want to start it. Like I had the hardest time starting it, did not want to do it because I knew it would take me hours to do it. I realized that I'm like wasting all this time thinking about starting it when I should actually be starting it and saving time so that afterwards, you know, I can do more assignments or I can get to the fun stuff later after I finish this one assignment so the hardest part really is just starting it so get over that little obstacle in your mind that's telling you how hard this is gonna be or how long it's gonna take just get over that part and just start it dude like you're gonna have to get it done anyway might as well just start it get it over with Alright guys, so that's gonna be the end of this video. A little bit of a different one, but super, super productive. Like I said, I encourage you guys to do something like this. Dedicate an entire day to just getting a whole bunch of crap done. Trust me, it's worth it. And I think I'm gonna do one of these videos every semester that I'm in college, because I feel like this isn't the only time that all this stuff is gonna pile up on me. So definitely gonna do some of these videos more often. But yeah guys, that's pretty much all I got for you guys for today. So as always guys, never stop dreaming and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace. Peace.